treated the same as dogs. Well, when it comes to reporting road accidents, that is. That's what a woman from Harrow is campaigning for. Her cat was run over and killed while she was on holiday and she didn't get to bury him. Julia Manns now wants it to be compulsory for councils to scan cats hit by cars for microchips so that they can be returned to their owners and given a proper burial. Frankie McCamley has more. Julie was on holiday when her cat Diesel got run over. A lovely lady who runs a local online lost and found site, um, a post popped up which said uh, cat killed. When I discovered it was a grey cat and I've got a grey cat, it, you know, obviously it was heartbreaking. I immediately rang my mum who lives about five minutes away to ask if she could come down and collect him because nobody had picked him up as far as I knew. But when she got here about ten past nine in the morning, he'd already, he'd already been taken. She didn't know where he'd been taken, so called the council. But by the time they finally got back to her, Diesel had been disposed of. It's bad enough losing your animal, but then not to be able to, to bury or cremate or whatever you want to do, it's horrible. You wouldn't do that to any other family member, and cats are our family members, so I just think that's really important. This is the um, microchip scanner that we use. Joe runs the team at the council who identify dead pets that are brought in. We have a, a procedure in place that if a cat or any animal is collected by the local authority, we scan it for a microchip. If a microchip is found, we record that microchip number, we look it up on the database and find out if there is an owner and notify the owner as soon as, as, soon as possible. As a result of what's happened, it's highlighted some concerns within the procedure which we are looking to address accordingly. UK law states that if you hit a dog with your car, you have to immediately report it to police. However, that's not the case when it comes to cats. Campaigners want to change that, though. They want to give both of our pets equal rights. As well as writing to all London councils asking for policy change when it comes to registering dead cats, Sean Berry is also supporting a bill to change the law. If this bill passes, it will make a real difference um, in a small way to lots of people. Uh, it will clean up a gap in the legislation where cats are not treated the same as dogs even. And it will save the heartache of a, a lot of people when they lose um, what is a member of their family. For Julie, it is a step in the right direction. However, she wishes a law like this was in place when she lost Diesel. Frankie McCamley, BBC London News.